Hello everyone, this is Taika from PancakeTaco.com and I am in the back of my house in Confederation Park in North Burnaby and um, just using the X-T2 as a vlogging camera which seems kind of insane because it's pretty big I'm just... I'm having problems with the exposure it just seems like it's always underexposing it could be the lens I have the uh, XF 10-24 it's an ultra wide angle and often I find that in general ultra wide angles tend to underexpose because you're getting a lot of um, uh, background so if I come in closer here maybe it'll focus on my face but it's been underexposing most of the morning I've been spending the last 20 minutes trying to figure out why it's underexposing so I'm just gonna shoot a video explaining where I'm at because people may be confused about how my Instagram my YouTube, my Twitter. I seem to be like either I'm in Japan, Hong Kong, or back in Canada. So I thought I would explain uh, where I'm at right now and how all the videos will be coming out in the very near future as I'm pumping them all out and my upcoming projects. And so let's uh, begin now. Hello everyone, this is Taka from BakerTaka.com and I'm coming to you here from Confederation Park, which is the park just behind my house. And I am shooting this video with the Fujifilm X-Pro2 and the XF23 F2 with the Rode Video Micro on top. Um, I shot the video using the X-Pro2 here and the uh, 23 F2 lens. I'm on autofocus here. Um, and so, um, what am I doing here? What I'm doing here is uh, I want to explain where I was at, where I am, and where I'm going because there seems to be a lack of continuity between my Instagram, my Twitter, my YouTube account, the articles that I write for Fuji Love Magazine, as well as my own blog. Um, I was in Hong Kong in uh, August into September for three weeks and while I was there I was working with Monogram Asia and Arcade Original and we shot tons of content uh, so much so that it would take months and it is taking months to roll out these videos we shot over 30 videos and we've uh, produced um, 21 so far which includes my vlogs but we still have like I think another 16 videos to go and so these videos will be rolling out right through December and maybe into January um, as well, I got back for a couple of weeks and then I took off to Osaka on vacation for three weeks with my wife, aka Camera Girl, for you YouTubers, uh, well, YouTube watchers, my YouTube audience. Uh, so, and I was there visiting my little brother, and you can see that in my Instagram feed. And while I was there, I was only able to shoot two videos because I decided I had all these great plans. I lined up some pretty cool uh, videos that I was going to shoot there, but I decided. You know, I was a bit burnt out from Hong Kong. I knew I overshot in terms of videos in Hong Kong, and there's no need to pile on more work on top of work I already wasn't getting done. So, shot two short videos. One was just an intro to uh, to Osaka. So, look out for that video, as well as the review of the XF23 F2 video, uh, XF23 F2 WR lens that I have right now that I'm shooting this video on. Uh, let's just say, fantastic lens. I'm really happy with it. Go to my Instagram account to look at some of the pictures that I've taken. As well, I wrote two articles for Fuji Love magazine that you can see, you know, bigger pictures and my overall um, thoughts on this lens. And uh, I think it's fantastic. And uh, I got back. I've been in Canada for a couple of weeks. And I've been just kind of plugging away, planning more projects up ahead. So I won't mention any of the ones that have not been confirmed. But uh, one of them has, which is uh, now has to do with where I'm going, which is I am going to San Diego. So I'll be there in a couple of days. And while I'm there, I will be vlogging. Uh, the decision to go was so quick that I don't have a review vlogging camera with me. So I thought I would use the X-T2. Um, maybe not the most common camera to use for vlogging, but uh, that's what I'm going to try. And um, yeah, uh, I'm going to have a good time there. Now, the reason why I'm going to San Diego was I was invited by Juan from Beers and Cameras to uh, join them on their one-year anniversary event. Uh, 
in San Diego. That's where the Beers and Camera, the boys and gals at Beers and Camera are. And so go uh, to, I think they have a website as well. I think the primary social media platform is Instagram. So check out the Instagram account as well, uh, Beers and Cameras. Uh, Juan also runs um, Brews and Cameras, which is similar to kind of the events that I get invited here in Vancouver, which is, uh, I hate the ambient noise. I hate construction noise. Anyway, so Juan, yeah, so Juan invited me, the the people at Beers and Cameras, which is basically Juan and his wife, they invited me to come down as their guest for their one year anniversary. So I uh, said yes. So thank you, Juan, for inviting me. And while I'm down there, I'll be able to take pictures and meet the people there at Beers and Cameras. It's going to be a great event. Uh, I won't give anything away, so just watch for that video. And that video, as well as my Tokyo videos, will be sort of... And this is kind of the reason why I'm doing this video, uh, is that my Hong Kong videos will continue being shot right through till December, January. But in the middle, you'll see my San Diego video with beers and cameras, as well as my, my Osaka, Japan video sort of embedded in the middle. So my I was trying to have this continuity in my videos, but meaning I finished all my Hong Kong videos, then my Osaka videos, and then all my current videos, but it's just it's just not going to happen. And so please uh, forgive me. If you want to see continuity, uh, it's probably best that you follow me on Twitter. Twitter is my most uh, up-to-date where I'm at, what I'm doing, where I'm going. That's usually where I post. Instagram, I'm so backed up with pictures. Like I still have tons of pictures from Hong Kong. And so I'm so backed up that I'm still posting my Osaka pictures, my Japan pictures, even though I'm back in Canada. And while I've been back in Canada, I've been taking pictures. And so I just feel so backed up uh, with pictures that um, there is no continuity across all my platforms. So please forgive me. So um, yeah, I think that's it. So uh, let's get ready to go. And um, uh, don't forget, you know, one of the things is, one of the things is people ask me like, why don't you say, uh, please don't forget to like, don't forget to follow, uh, tell your friends. I do kind of say in the description, I, um, I don't know, is it effective when people say, you know, please go ninja on the like button, please, please subscribe. I think if you like my videos, you just subscribe, right? And if you like, um, maybe some people don't know that, you know, when you like, it does help because when we look for sponsors and we look for um, ways to improve our channel, you know, it's a good gauge for us to know what people like, what they don't like. And when people dislike, it's nice to know why. And so maybe they're afraid to hurt my feelings. Um, I don't really know what people aren't liking when they don't say, I don't really care if a video gets tons of dislikes. Often when I do a controversial camera like like MD or if I do some kind of an iPhone video, it tends to get the most dislikes. Or if I do my click clicks, or something, people are like, I hate it, stop doing it. Um, you know, I try to balance what I like to do versus what people want to see, but you know, I'm, I'm not stopping the click clicks. I do it when I want, and I won't do it when I don't feel like it. Uh, I appreciate people uh, trying to give me advice on what to do and what not to do. I, I really do. I do listen and I do read the comments as best as I can, but um, you know, I, I try to be myself and true to myself and do what I want. And if you don't like it, well then, you know what, there's lots of great uh, Instagram accounts or a lot of great YouTube channels, lots of great Twitter accounts. Um, so, you know, go follow them and uh, you can come and visit me once in a while. So anyways, uh, thanks for watching. We'll see you in San Diego and we will talk to you soon. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. We'll talk to you soon. Happy shooting.